What's up, Calc Gang? Welcome back to some dynamics. So we have this problem here. So we have these two blocks. One of them is spinning in a circle on a table, and it's attached to this rope that goes through the center of the table, and it's lifting up block A. So we need to find that the velocity of this block B needs to travel in this circle in order to hold up block A. So let's go ahead and get solvent for that. So we're in chapter 13, so we're making force body diagrams and doing forces equal to mass times acceleration. So let's start with block A, right? Here is Y and here's X. And so of course, block A is gonna have a weight because it's 15 kilograms. So let's go ahead and draw that. So this is the force gravity of A. And then because we have a weight, we have something holding it up. So of course we're gonna have that tension. So we want A to stay at rest, right? We don't want it to go up or down. So we want to have no acceleration. So when we take the sum of the forces in the y direction, we need to set that equal to zero because an acceleration needs to be equal to zero. So then if we add it up, we get negative force gravity of A plus uh, tension. And then we get that tension is just equal to the weight of A. So we can label that even further. Tension is equal to mass of A times gravity. Okay, so we have this, but we need to find the velocity of B. How are we gonna do that? Well, let's draw another force body diagram. Let me go over here. And this time, it's for block A. So for, or I mean block B. Okay. A bean. All right, so block B this time. So block B, we might wanna split it up into a different coordinate system because all we're gonna find is that the normal force is equal to the block's weight. But we want to use normal tangent components because normal tangent components allows us to find velocity. Uh, and that'll make sense later. So if we were making this, let's make this the tangent direction and this the normal direction. So looking at our graph, the normal direction would be inwards where the tension is pulling, and the tangent direction is just tangent to that path that it's following. So if we're looking at like this, well, the thing that's happening is we have a tension force in the normal direction. Um, yeah. So I guess however you're looking at it, but this is normal. This is pointing inwards towards the center of the circle. We're gonna have that tension force. And now this tension force is gonna be equal to this tension force because it's the same rope. And there's kind of a frictionless thing going on there. But now, when we set some of the forces in the normal direction, we need to set it to mass times acceleration in the normal direction. And acceleration in the normal direction allows us to find velocity. So if we do this, it's equal to tension. Okay, so what do we do next? Well, we go ahead and we keep mass the same. Now acceleration normal is velocity squared over the radius of curvature. Right now that's where velocity comes in, that's why we're doing this. So then tension is equal to mass of A times gravity. I need, I need to specify that this is mass of B. So then if we're going to solve for velocity, let's just divide by mass of B. Um, hopefully I did this right. Where is my notes? I can't even read it anymore. Anyway, velocity squared, right? Let's just divide by B, multiply by radius of curvature. Divide by mass of B. And of course we're gonna take the square root in order to find velocity. So let's do the square root. Radius of curvature is 1.5 meters, because that's the radius of the rope on that table. Mass of A is 15 kilograms, gravity is 9.81, and mass of B is two. So solve for this, you get that needs to be traveling 10.5 meters a second in that circle in order to complete this. So there you go, that's how you solve this problem. Uh, pretty easy, right? But it's not getting too complicated uh, yet, so check out my channel for more complicated problems. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments, and thanks for all your support. See you in the next video. Peace.